now into the hands of Spano, the emotional leader for Greece. Down low to Fazula, and she gets the roll early on. Lovely soft touch, and I told you that's a good start. Laxa, lovely screen action down low to try and feel space for Gorba. Oh, and she draws a foul, another and one play, this time for Zula. And that's a big score from Stroudman coming in off the bench to now the three. On the menu, I'm OK. But... And my uh, Latvian's not bad either. Well, you have experience in Latvia, right? Real on-ball pressure. Again, unorthodox, but she gets the three to drop. Aki scoops up the loose ball. That is a long three. Oh, and she drains it. That is from way downtown for Eliana Kristinaki. Let me put this one to you, and it's not meant in a negative way. Has this resurgent coincided with Pazula taking a seat on the bench, or am I just... Is that pure coincidence? No, no. Cut. Oh, lovely spin move, high off the glass, very composed. Zula goes to the reverse layup, and Fazula looks a lot more locked in in this second half. They get movement and get shots wide open, they look fantastic. Spano, another three. Oh, Spano is feeling it here in Tel Aviv. Great answer back. And for Sulas, it's been really fun to watch as Spanu misses that three. Laxa, quick release. Oh, strong music for Laxa. We're into nearly seven minutes left to play. Five point game. Spanu, spin move, right hand. Of course it goes in. It's Spanu. Spanu with the spin. We love it. Steinberger, spin move, Spanu matches it with the footwork. Golba, another three at the top. Oh, it's raining threes again. Stabber Lampro. Oh, she finds a way to the basket and she finds a way to a three point play. Down, Stabber Lampro. What a play, just found some space and wow. And this is so important because when it comes down to potentially... Um, Drives the baseline, kicks it out, Pulver doesn't hit the three, and that will be the end of the game, and that blows this group wide open. What a second-half performance.